brainwaves of adept yogis compared to people who've not meditated or ordinary people. Uh, the highest state in yoga is called samadhi, and it is characterized by really high alpha all over the head. And um, one time, uh, first time I was in India, uh, I was working with a yogi who was brought to me. When he walked into the room, it was as though the sun had come up. He had a beatific radiance. We wired him up, and he started to meditate, doing his yoga meditation. And every two minutes, the computer would print out the scores. And the first epoch was high alpha. The second, all of the alpha on every channel in his head had gone up. The next uh, two minutes, everything had gone up. The next mi two minutes, everything had gone up. Now, whether it's a stock market or brainwaves, if you're on a roll, typically what you get is this. He just went straight up. It's what mathematicians would call a monotonic increase. He never went down. There were a couple scores that were the same as the previous epoch, but after about 20 minutes, I'm like, how is this possible? After about an hour, he opened his eyes. There was a flash of light came out. It was like, it was bright as the sun. And he spoke in Hindi, it was translated. He said, well, I'd like to go on, but the light is getting so bright that if I go any further, I won't be able to come back and tell you about it. So the brainwaves of yoga masters are very different from the brainwaves of ordinary people.